Ladies and gentlemen, welcome and thanks for joining. I do love the abilities artificial intelligence gives to those who know how to use them. But there might be another dark side of possibilities that may even have a greater impact on our life than just AI's impact on the job market. Imagine a world where everything you can hear or see can be faked. I mean we already know that a lot of things in history have been actually quite different when you start to look into these in details. But in the future, everything you can see on TV can be faked to the extent that you will not be able to tell if this is a fake or not. I am not Morgan Freeman, and what you see is not real. If you can see, hear, taste, or smell something, does that make it real? It will be too well done to distinguish the truth from fake. So as an example, if two candidates run for election, then one side can create a deep fake of the opponent and create some nasty video about them, maybe filmed by surveillance cameras, doing something bad. And because it is so well done by the AI so that you can literally not see any difference if it is real or not, that is the big problem. It is then like in The Running Man, where they can create whatever thing they want about anybody, not just politicians but also the normal walking person in the streets if there is any reason to do so. Maybe such person has been shown been aligned too much to an unwanted narrative. So a little compromising incident could be created at very low costs to make that person lose the job or getting arrested. So this would be a risk for every true opposition. They could be immediately discredited and stopped, not to forget who controls the media. And if they all run again a similar narrative and a real looking video is shown of what supposedly happened then you can be sure that this is what people will believe. For 50 years we've told them what to eat. What to drink? What to wear? Americans love television. And not just the people. The enforcement agencies will have a hard time not believing it was you if the person on the video has your face and your voice. And how do you want to disprove that it is fake if all the let's say experts in this field are sponsored by the same government who did the video? As a result, it would be pretty much impossible for anybody, even the most advanced truth researcher, to distinguish fake from reality. It will just be so perfect. In the past, you could see if things didn't match up like Photoshop details in pictures and film or CGI. But in the very near future, that CGI will be just so good that you really can't tell the difference at all. How do you know then what is fake and what not? It will be impossible. So this can be used to discredit someone, but it can also be used the other way around. So let's say there's a politician and he has done notorious things, but he lost his laptop and all evidence is on it. Then such evidence could be used to highlight his crimes and get him to justice. Well, in theory at least. As we have seen in recent history, this process already is not working as the agencies involved in that matter just don't do anything with that information and the media is not reporting on it as well. But at least for someone who digs a bit deeper, you could still find these things out. But in the future, this process could be turned on its head. The compromised politician could just say it is a deep fake and that it is not him in the film doing the crime shown. And then he has the so-called independent experts or fact checkers that confirm that it is a deep fake even though it is not. The film was showing the truth but now nobody will believe it anymore, so this would work both ways, to compromise someone or to destroy a compromising problem. This is a very big dilemma, and the media phrases it already in that direction how a bad actor could manipulate the outcomes of elections and so on. Of course a bad actor is always the one with a different opinion. We know this, so need to look forward to the next election it will most likely become an even crazier fake wrestling show match than the other ones. But as said, it must not be on the top political level. Maybe it is done with someone you believe in with a large audience, or someone who speaks the truth or you believe in. Well, they could just make a damaging deep fake about such person and then it's game over. So this artificial intelligence enhanced CGI is a very powerful weapon that can easily be misused and everybody can be targeted quite cheaply. So you really need to keep this in mind. From now on going forward, it will become even less possible to distinguish the truth from fake, and that will lead to a whole new dimension of what can be sold to the people as truth and what not. And most likely it would further diminish the potential for anybody good to bring in some real change, challenging the existing power structure. Because how can anybody win against this impossible strong power to manipulate and deceive? It is another turning point for humanity that once we have crossed the line of CGI becoming so good, then there is never a way to turn back from this anymore. Truth and fake become indistinguishable. Hope that information is helpful. If so, please like and subscribe, that would be awesome. Thanks for watching and all the very best to you.